next presenter starred in Netflix's Bird Box, a movie where people survive by acting like they don't see a thing. Sort of like working for Harvey Weinstein. Last night at my direction, the United States military successfully executed a flawless precision strike that killed the number one terrorist anywhere in the world, Qasem Soleimani. Once we've left, we are never coming back, and the rest, frankly, is detail. We're going, we will be gone. Goodbye, Gandalf. Sophia Cannon's improbable American dream. The accounts of Democratic candidate Joe Biden, President Barack Obama, and even super genius Elon Musk, among many others, were taken over. I think you called me a liar on national TV. <laughs> Let's go. It's so bad down there, you guys. Get out of there. All I want is my family. All I want is to be safe. You don't want to go down there. Oh my God, guys. The US Navy has finally acknowledged that videos appearing to show UFOs flying through the air are real. They don't call them UFOs. They call them unidentified aerial phenomena. It's been a long time since I've said thank you to anybody. Weinstein will be sentenced on March the 11th. He faces a minimum of five years in jail. Retired Los Angeles Lakers basketball star Kobe Bryant has been killed in a helicopter crash. It happened this morning. This is the man who warned the world when authorities stayed silent. Lee Wen Liang told others in December of the new virus similar to SARS, the outbreak that killed hundreds in the early 2000s. Authorities punished him for speaking out. Now, just 34 years old, with a wife and child, he succumbed to the virus. From this evening, I must give the British people a very simple instruction. You must stay at home. The decision is just today is to stay at home. The future of our country is in our hands. China is battling a new and rapidly spreading respiratory virus. The number of people infected has tripled to more than 200. And President Xi says it needs to be resolutely contained. This noise is the army saying, don't come out, stay in your house. We are all now preparing as a nation to go into self-isolation. All South Africans will have to stay at home. If anyone is thinking, taking any chances, just take a look at me. I'm in the intensive care unit. How do we get here? How did that happen? How did it happen? It's not an accident. It didn't happen by accident. It's a long process of kind of giving up, little by little, little by little, taking the hand off the wheel and just cruising and coasting. And this is where it leads you. As I said before, they, they gave me time to devote to the movement. A huge explosion in the Lebanese capital, Beirut. Introducing iPhone 12. As always, the new iPhone comes in two types, doesn't count, and the actual one. Folks, the people of this nation have spoken. I never yield dead. As you can see, I am not dead. Alan? Alan, I'm here. So what's the plan? The COVID-19 vaccine trials are starting to come in. This has been my co-worker all day. <laughs> There's one we owe you. It makes people smile. Um, and do stop me. If you need to crack on, do, do tell us. Well, this has gone south very quickly. <laughs> about that. She woke herself up. <laughs> <laughs> Holy smokes. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah.